Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how we at Professor Gregory Weiss's lab at the University of California, Irvine have found a way to boil, unboil, and then reboil an egg. So what we have here is an egg. We're going to go ahead and just break it up here. We're going to collect the egg white. And then we're going to go ahead and boil it. So we're going to take a little bit of it, put it in a tube, and then boil it at about 90 degrees Celsius for about 20 minutes. I have one that's already done, which you can see right here. So what we do now is we take this egg white and dissolve it in a chemical called urea. So this egg white now is white because it features a bunch of uh, tangled up proteins of the egg, all not no longer in their natural state. So to get it back out of, into its natural state, we first have to dissolve the egg white. And so normally we spin this for about 16 hours or so overnight. I have one that is already ready to go. So you can see the egg white is a little bit uh, dissolved in there and the solution looks cloudy. We now take that dilute down the urea a little bit. So there's eight molar urea. We're gonna dilute that to one molar urea, which will be uh, much more beneficial for the proteins. And then once we do that, we are ready to refold our protein. So we now take our dissolved egg whites into this machine here. It's called the Vortex Fluid Device. This machine was developed by our collaborators in Australia, Dr. Colin Raston at Flinders University. The way the instrument works is it spins at a certain degree and certain speed. The egg white creates this thin film, or the egg protein makes a thin film along the tube, stretching out those proteins, giving them another chance to properly refold. This process is not necessarily important for the egg proteins, but is more relevant with cancerous proteins and proteins associated with other, other diseases in which we could use this therapeutically. So we spin the egg whites for five minutes at 5,000 RPM. So after our five minutes are up, we take the egg out of the device, and now we're gonna fry it up and show you that we can reboil it again. So now once our egg is done, we go ahead and suck it up with this pipette, and then bam, boil it back on the hot plate.